Saints know a righteous woman. Yes. Hallelujah. And I make the skin crawl. Hallelujah. I set the demons at attention. I make them uneasy. Right. Hallelujah. And I want to make them uneasy. That's right. Hallelujah. Because I want to know them. I'm there. Hallelujah. And I will cast you out if you give me a chance. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. No fear in me. You can't be no punk servant of the Lord. Can't be no coward servant of the Lord. He wants a bold soldier. Hallelujah. A bold soldier working in his army. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. 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 With the right hand, the right kind of prayer, you can stop the Jezebel spirit. You need transition yourself. Hallelujah. God got to transform your mind first. Transition, transform your mind once you have heard the word over and over and over. And the word has sink down in your heart and you have a relationship with him and you say well how do you know that God can heal me because God healed me Amen. hallelujah from syphilis Amen. God healed me yes my first husband gave it to me he was in the army hallelujah 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 and God healed me from it God healed me hallelujah listen to me good Hallelujah. From cancer in my left breast. It laid in there for two weeks. And I told the Lord, it's in the wrong house. Oh my God. Hallelujah. You told me if I serve you, Lord. Hallelujah. Any unrighteous thing wouldn't abide in my body. When I go back to the doctor, Lord, I don't want this cancer in the left breast. I didn't tell the church. I didn't tell my kids. I don't never tell y'all nothing to God heal me. And when God healed me, then that's what I told you. God healed me from, hallelujah, diabetes. Yeah. Hallelujah, because why? I believe wholeheartedly in the Lord. I don't second guess the Lord. Because I know what power he can do. God healed me from a massive stroke. Hallelujah. Everybody saw me, hallelujah, when I had my stroke. You saw how it left my hand crippled. Left my leg crippled. I couldn't even walk. Couldn't even use this hand. Didn't even know this arm was on my body. Y'all saw the condition I was in. I was living in Connecticut. Don't you tell me what God won't do. You're looking to a woman, hallelujah, that's been through everything. Hallelujah. And God has rescued. God has saved and delivered her out of everything. So I know, hallelujah, how the devil attacks your body. I know how the devil tries to destroy your mind. I know how the devil tries to destroy your future. I know how the devil don't want you to graduate. Don't want you to go to college. Don't want you to get married. Don't want anything to happen to you. But I'm here to tell you, you can have a good life. You can get married. You can be somebody with Christ in your life. Amen. Only do only what you do for Christ will last. Amen. Everything else is gonna fail. Amen. Gotta keep Christ in your life. I've been teaching my children ever since they've been born. Ever since my children were on my lap, they were clapping and praising the Lord. Mikey used to stand up, couldn't even reach the pedal, couldn't even reached the drum. Hallelujah. Yeah. Couldn't even reach sing. But he was beating the drum. <laughs> At the age of two. Beating yes. the drum. Hallelujah. And can play them too. I'm not talking about beat. Actually play. Hallelujah. You don't tell me. Joshua was praising the Lord when he was six months. His first word was hallelujah. Hallelujah. Six months years old. Josh been singing every since. My kids been singing hallelujah every since. I would taught them to sing and to praise God. Read their Bible and to pray. Hallelujah. You don't have to tell nobody you're praying. You can sit and 